Welcome to Technology and Livelihood Education. Modatag Curriculum. Technology and Livelihood Education for Grade 7. Information and Communication Technology. Our topic is, Qualities of Successful Entrepreneur in the Field of ICT. The content standard for this lesson is, to demonstrate an understanding of the qualities of successful Filipino entrepreneurs in the field of ICT. The learning competency is, to discuss the qualities of a successful Filipino entrepreneurs in the field of ICT. By the end of the lesson, students will be able to identify key qualities of successful ICT entrepreneurs. Discuss the qualities of a successful Filipino entrepreneurs. Understand how these qualities apply in real-world scenarios. Discuss and reflect on the importance of these qualities for pursuing a career in ICT. What comes to your mind when you think of a successful entrepreneur? An entrepreneur is someone who starts, organizes, and manages a business or businesses, often taking on financial risks in the hope of profit. Entrepreneurs are typically characterized by their innovation, creativity, and willingness to take risks. They identify opportunities, develop new ideas or products, and create solutions to meet market needs. The Entrepreneur One of the duties of an entrepreneur is to create solutions. Establishing a business is about more than just making money, it's also about opening doors and bringing new ideas to the market. Given that the Philippine startup scene is still in its infancy but is expected to grow significantly over the next several years, several entrepreneurs have stepped forward to take the lead in enhancing the nation-building platforms that are already in place. The Philippines is the home of tech geniuses. One of the nation's fastest-growing economic sectors is information technology, which is also home to a number of tech startups. Since they have been supporting one another in raising capital, expanding their networks of potential customers and investors, and developing nationwide platforms, all Filipino startups are interconnected. But managing a tech startup comes with a number of challenges. It's likely that some problems can only be solved by a business that handles incidents of this nature. The following are the famous entrepreneurs in the field of ICT. One of the famous entrepreneurs in the field of ICT is Mr. Orlando Vea. He said, today's disruption is tomorrow's business as usual. That's a fact of life. Before you're able to disrupt, you have to disrupt yourself first. And we can turn disruptions into business opportunities. In his speech, during the Business World Economic Forum held last May 18th, 2018 at Grand Hyatt Manila. In one of the afternoon sessions titled, Finding Opportunities in the Age of Disruption. Mr. Orlando Vea is the founder of Smart Communications Incorporated, founded in 1991, and held the title of director from 2011 to 2012. He is also the founder of Paymaya Philippines Incorporated. Mr. Vea's current jobs include, President and Chief Executive Officer at Sat Ventures Incorporated, Chief Executive Officer at Voyager Innovations Incorporated, Chairman President at T1 Vision Incorporated, Chairman at Fertag Realty Incorporated, Chairman at Peakview Properties Incorporated, Director at Meridian Telecoms, Inc. He is also the Director at Kalyan College, President Director at Digital Mobile Philippines Incorporated. Director at NetGames Inc. Director at Digital Paradise Incorporated. Director at iContacts Corporation. Director at Smart Hub Incorporated. Director at Smart Money Incorporated. Director at Wolfpack Mobile Incorporated. Director at Mobile Payment Solutions PTE Limited. Director at Morph Labs Incorporated, Philippines. Board of Director at Ideaspace Foundation Inc., Venture Capital. His former jobs include President, Chief Executive Officer and Director at MediaQuest Holdings Incorporated, 
President and Chief Executive Officer at PLDT Communications Energy Ventures Inc. from 2008 to 2011. President and Director at Digital Telecommunications Philippines Inc. President and Director at Prime World Digital Systems Inc. And President, Chief Executive Director and Director at Mediascape, Inc. Mr. Orlando Vea, graduated cum laude, from the University of the Philippines with a degree in economics in 1970. Another Filipino famous entrepreneur is Mr. Joey Durango. Or Coach Joey. His advocacy is digital transformation that leads to data governance and ethical artificial intelligence. He is the chairman and CEO of Zerpas Incorporated, chairman of the Copies ICT Council, chairman of Miharas Gorango Craniofacial Foundation. He is one of the 10 most outstanding technopreneurs for Philippine Center for Entrepreneurship. He received an Azure Flare Award from IPAP, or Information Technology and Business Process Association of the Philippines. During the early stages of the personal computer revolution, in the 1980s, he started his profession. He was hired by Apple Computer in 1982 as a product support engineer for the Lisa, the Macintosh's forerunner. Additionally, he was employed by Microsoft in 1986 as a programmer for Excel for Windows version 1. In 1991, he returned to the Philippines and joined multiple software businesses, one of which was acquired by Microsoft in 1999. Coach Joey has been assisting hundreds of startup entrepreneurs and business owners with the development of their digital businesses since 2011. In 2022, he was appointed as the CEO and chairman of the board of Zerpas, the only publicly listed software technology company in the Philippines. Joey's current advocacy at Zerpas is digital transformation that leads to effective data governance and ethical artificial intelligence. Another famous entrepreneur in the field of ICT is Diane Estequio. Every like-minded Filipino visionary believes that the path to nation-building involves entrepreneurship, which would pave the way for innovation and development. Filipinos need the right opportunity to turn their ideas into a reality, said Diana Estequio during her interview with TechShake. Estequio is the executive director of Ideaspace, a nonprofit organization that nurtures the organic growth of early-stage startups by providing seed funding, and also by incubating and accelerating them. Her story before she became a successful entrepreneur a year after graduating from college in 1992, she tried the life of a full-time entrepreneur where she came face-to-face -face with the challenges in starting and running a business in the Philippines. In 1994 and 1995, as newlyweds, together with her husband started a business and closed it in less than a year. They ran out of money, did not research enough, had no support structure, it sent her into depression. She cried for two days straight when it finally hit her that they failed. Failure and understanding that they needed more wisdom to run a business. She is the executive director, Ideaspace Foundation. The Philippines' first holder of a business incubation management certificate from the International Business Innovation Association. Assumed the role of executive director when First Pacific launched Ideaspace in 2012. Another famous Filipino entrepreneur in the field of ICT is Mr. John Scotty Havalona. John Scotty Havalona is the co-founder and chief visionary officer of Orange Apps Incorporated. He is known as the Pinoy Steve Jobs, who founded the very first school mobile portal application during his junior year at Polytechnic University of the Philippines. He is a visionary who wants to change people's lives by building revolutionary products, making his first company Orange Apps Incorporated. Funded by the leading incubator in the country Ideaspace Foundation, Microsoft Corporation, and other angel investors from the Philippines. He represented the Philippines on the first reality TV show in Channel News Asia Singapore, where he is the youngest and the only Filipino company who got it to the top 10. He was awarded by Manila Bulletin as Top 7 Newsmakers of 2012. 
He was named as the PUP Innovator of the Year 2013 and under 30 Young Achievers of Meg Magazine. His vision is to change the way the world learns. Launching his new product, Kauna, that aims to make education available on your fingertips. At 19, Havalona launched the first mobile app for a school in the Philippines that covers access to students' records and enrollment forms. Becoming a national media celebrity in the process. He admitted he started out hacking his own school systems. He now runs Orange Apps, a cloud-based platform where schools and universities can manage multiple processes like student enrollment, grades, HR, and payroll. The following are the qualities of a successful entrepreneur. The first quality that the entrepreneur should have is visionary thinking. It is the ability to see and articulate future opportunities and trends that others may not recognize. Next is the innovation and creativity. Creativity in developing new products, services, or business models that address market needs in novel ways. Next is professionalism. It is the deep enthusiasm for the business or industry, which drives sustained effort and perseverance. Dedication, commitment, and diligence in working towards business goals and overcoming challenges. Next is the risk-taking. It is the willingness to take calculated risks, to pursue opportunities and innovate, despite potential setbacks. Another quality that the entrepreneur should have is the passion. Passion is a powerful quality for entrepreneurs, driving motivation, resilience, and innovation. It's a key factor that helps entrepreneurs overcome challenges, inspire others, and ultimately achieve success. Next is the planning. Planning is a foundational quality for successful entrepreneurs. It involves setting clear goals, developing strategies, allocating resources, managing risks, and adapting to changes. Effective planning enhances decision-making, ensures efficient resource use, and helps entrepreneurs navigate the complexities of building and growing a business. Next is knowledge. It is a fundamental quality for successful entrepreneurs, encompassing a broad understanding of various aspects crucial to running and growing a business. It involves acquiring and applying information, skills, and expertise in areas such as industry trends, market dynamics, business operations, and strategic management. The social skills. Social skills are essential qualities for successful entrepreneurs, encompassing the ability to effectively interact, communicate, and build relationships with others. These skills are crucial for various aspects of entrepreneurship, from networking and team management to customer relations and negotiations. Every entrepreneur should have open-mindedness towards learning, people, and even failure. It is a crucial quality for successful entrepreneurs. It refers to the willingness to embrace new ideas, perspectives, and experiences, and to remain receptive to learning, understanding others, and adapting to failure. This trait significantly enhances an entrepreneur's ability to innovate, grow, and navigate the complexities of business. Next is empathy. Empathy is a vital quality for successful entrepreneurs. It involves understanding and relating to others' emotions and perspectives, which enhances customer satisfaction, team dynamics, and decision-making. By developing and applying empathy, entrepreneurs can build stronger relationships, foster a positive work environment, and drive their business towards success. Next is the value for client or customer. Providing value for clients or customers is a fundamental quality for successful entrepreneurs. It involves understanding and meeting customer needs, offering high-quality products and services, enhancing the overall customer experience, and building strong relationships. By focusing on delivering genuine value, entrepreneurs can foster customer loyalty, differentiate their business, and achieve long-term success. And one of the most important to make the business last for a long time is the adaptability. The technology evolves rapidly, so the ability to pivot and adapt your business model or product offerings in response to new developments is crucial. Possessing these entrepreneurial qualities before starting a business significantly increases your chances of success.
They help you navigate the complexities of starting and running a business, respond to challenges effectively, and build a strong foundation for growth. Without them, you might face difficulties in strategic planning, managing resources, and staying competitive in the market. A time to remember. This is Mylene Huliganga. Thank you for watching.